Hi everybody, this is Leah Martin from Running Remote and in today's video we're going to be talking about employee boxes. We send these out to all of our new employees at Time Doctor, which is one of the SaaS companies that I have co-founded and I'm going to break down in this video exactly where I got the boxes, how we got them together, exactly how much they cost and most importantly how much it costs to actually ship these boxes throughout 43 countries all around the world. Stay tuned. So employee boxes are um, something that we do at Time Doctor and all of actually the companies that I am involved in. And it is fundamentally a box that really shows a brand new employee that comes into the company, what we stand for, who we are as a company, and it includes a whole bunch of awesome, really good swag inside of it. I don't know about you guys, but the vast majority of the time that I see swag, it's usually like a $10 t-shirt or some kind of crappy pen. And to be completely honest with you, you usually end up throwing all that stuff out. So not with this box. We actually spend $200.79 per box, uh, and that does not include shipping to be able to get this to one of our team members anywhere on planet Earth. So in this video, I'm gonna be breaking down, as I said, what's in the box, why we chose those things in the box, and exactly how much it cost us. Spoiler alert, just this year, it has cost us approximately $37,000, five, 152 bucks, I believe, to be able to send out these onboarding boxes to new team members. So the box, uh, it is again, branded with all of our branding. The company that we worked with was a company called Brand Boulevard. You can check them out in the links below, brandboulevard.ca. And when you open the box, uh, it's a black on black kind of tier. Uh, one of the things that we looked at was actually having kind of our mission statement printed on the top here or in the bottom. This is not something that we decided to do because it was actually gonna cost us something like seven or eight dollars more per box because you can only print on one side for some type of pricing. Again, the actual logistics of this is pretty interesting. Go to Brand Boulevard, talk to them. They'll be able to give you pricing on everything as it connects to this stuff. Now, here's the biggest thing that we give everyone right out of the box. You guys have heard probably a few times if you've not been subscribed to this channel. By the way, subscribe to this channel, like this video because it really helps out the algorithm and uh, it would be a personal favor to me. I always talk about the best earbuds on the market and the best earbuds on the market if you're buying both a Apple or a uh, Windows machine is really these. It is the, it is the Bose Sound Sport Ultras. They cost $137 per pair. They're a little bit more cost effective than the, than the AirPod Pros, which I also use on a regular basis. However, this works for both PC and Mac very, very easily. And it actually has better ear control or like the, the ear cups are more comfortable for more different types of ears. So when you actually open it up, here's something that's super cool. When you open up the entire thing, you get obviously this presentation here and you think, oh yeah, this is just a standard set of Bose earbuds. No, it's not. We actually have our own branded pouch uh, for, whoops, I dropped it, for the, uh, for the Bose Sound True Ultras. So it's really one of those things, uh, as I said before, don't send people crap in the, their merch bag. Send them stuff that's really good and they actually will use it. So we've tested 11 different sets of earbuds to be able to come to this set, which is the Bose Sound True Ultras. And they're really amazing. Um, as you probably heard if you've watched any of my videos, it's pretty awesome. It can just hang right behind you. They plug right in and they have fantastic, fantastic microphones, which is why we've decided to go with them. Next thing on the list is actually uh, our mission values. So very simplistic, black and white branding. Our colors are actually orange, but for employees, we provide 
kind of like an exclusive version of this. So if you're one of our VIP customers at Time Doctor, you'll probably be getting one of these onboarding boxes, but they're not in black and white. This is only for employees. So we have our logo on the front and then we have uh, what we stand for as a company. So we are basically a company that is trying to facilitate the world's acceleration towards transitioning towards remote work. We're a work insights company and we want to get 1 million paid users by December 2025. And if you actually want to learn more about what we stand for as a company, I have a video about that as well that uh, I am thinking about putting together. And if you're interested, please put it down in the comments below of how we came to this document. We've actually spent like 200 hours working on this cute little document. So uh, if you want a video like that, please let me know in the comments below. Next thing is I'm always telling people to stay hydrated when they work remotely. And I always keep a big water bottle right next to my, uh, my workstation. So we get a really nice branded water bottle. So again, the black and white motif, we've got Time Doctor. And if you'll even notice, we have the, uh, the logo laser engraved on the wood cap, which is pretty darn cool. And when you take it off, again, it's something that's BPA free. We made sure that it's all stainless steel. You can smash this thing around as much as you want. This actually cost us, and let me get the numbers up here. It cost us $20 even, which was pretty crazy. So this was $20 per the Bose Sound True Ultras was one, were one hundred and thirty seven dollars. The Mission Vision and Values print material was four dollars. The actual picking and packing of all of this was six dollars, and the swag box, the actual box that everything came in, was eight dollars to be able to do that. And last but not least, we also have our T-shirt, which was twenty five dollars, and. There was an option to be able to have like a $10 t-shirt, but again, people hate $10 t-shirts. They throw them away. We buy $25 t-shirts, particularly for our employees, because that's the people that we serve the most inside of the company. And again, I did nerdy stuff like literally trying on five to six different t-shirts at different price points to be able to figure out which one was the best. Spoiler alert, I chose the most expensive t-shirt. Uh, I don't know if you guys know, but I always wear black t-shirts and uh, it's pretty much the only thing that I have in my house. So it was a very easy decision for me to be able to purchase a high quality one. So altogether, that was $200.79 and shipping within Canada or the United States was 15 to $20 approximately for North America. And then international shipping was 80 to $100. And one of the other things that the team at Brand Boulevard told us was actually there's certain countries where there's significant import taxes. So there was an import tax of 80% for Egypt. There was a 30 to 40% import tax for Argentina, Indonesia, and a bunch of other countries. So when you actually look at the all of the costs for shipping and import taxes, it was more than the cost of the box. Now, you might say to yourself, Liam, that's incredibly stupid. Why would you pay $200 for import taxes and uh, shipping costs on a $200 box? Well, I'll give you the answer. It allows everyone to align and it allows everyone to be able to open up the same box and really say, hey, you know what? This isn't some weird company that I just kind of get magically paid for while I'm working from home. This company really exists and this is what this company does on a daily basis. This is its missions and values and what it finds important. And uh, it really elevates your team members to a completely new level, particularly in the onboarding process where no one really knows really whether or not these companies are real or not. So uh, it's very cool to be able to get a box like that. One of the other things that I might mention is when you send these boxes out, do not tell your employee that you're actually sending the box out. Make it a surprise. People 
love it. A lot of people think to themselves, oh, well, it was my birthday this week. I got this great box and maybe it was because of my birthday or maybe it was because of something else. They're always way more pleasantly surprised when you surprise them as opposed to telling them, hey, there's a box coming, you might want to keep an eye out for it. So if you have any questions about how to actually put together your own employee onboarding box for a remote worker, please let me know down in the comments below. And while you're down there, why don't you like and subscribe to this YouTube channel? It is indeed free and we talk about this stuff all day long. See you in the next video.